Yeah, this problem is based on the blanking stress or the shear stress. So generally this type of problems we can find in the uh, plane sheet or the sheet metal. Okay, so here how we can make the analysis of this, we'll see. So first let us read the question. Find the minimum size of the hole. So that can be punched in a 20 mm thick of a mild steel plate having the ultimate shear stress is 300 Newton per millimeter square and the compressive stress in the punch material is 1200 Newton per millimeter square. Okay, so let me assume here there is an a sheet. So the sheet having a thickness say T is the thickness of the sheet and it will be punched it means there is a press tool that is blanking press which is used to be make the hole in the sheet so the punch say this is a punch So you need to find the minimum size of the hole that can be punched in a 20 mm thick mild steel plate. So thickness of the plate is T is equal to 20 mm okay and the shear stress in the material that is tau is 300 Newton per millimeter square and the maximum permissible, permissible compressive stress that is sigma C compressive stress in the punch material okay so in the punch material the compressive stress is 1200 newton per millimeter square so the now question is what is the minimum size of the hole that can be punched in a 20 mm thick okay so minimum hole it can be punched in this thickness of the plate having this uh, stresses okay that you need to find out so let let us say the diameter will be d d will be the diameter of the hole size of the hole that you need to be find out okay say d is the diameter of the hole So now the solution is the force applied by the punch force applied by punch so how much force is applied that we will calculate first so is f let us say f will say f is the force which is applying here so F is equal to the crushing stress into the cross section of the punch, area of cross section of the punch. So sigma C is equal to 1200 into cross section area. So it is in circle so formula will be pi by 4 into d square for a circular shaft. So say this is f. So let us say f1 is for the force applied by the punch. Okay. Now what is the resisting strength in the whole part? Second one resisting strength. in the whole part that is F2 is equal to it is shear stress into the area of 
resistance tau into variable resistance is pi dt okay so shear stress is given tau is equal to 300 into pi d t is uh, is given as 20 means the plate thickness okay so this is f2 say this is equation 1 and this is equation number 2 now equate both the equation 192 so 1200 into pi by 4 d square is equal to 300 into pi d into 20 yeah so this one d will be cancelled and pi pi then 4 on j so it's 300 300 and this 300 both will get cancelled again okay so d is equal to now the remaining is only 20 so 20 mm okay so 20 mm is the whole diameter that we can uh, make the punching for this plane okay so this is the solution so diameter of the whole 20 mm that can be punched is the correct answer 20 mm right so thank you for watching have a good day